Empedocles had quite a following. He was supposed to have been some sort of a mystic, guru, doctor, philosopher, healer. Supposedly he could heal people. And of course a person like that should have a spectacular death, right? So the story goes that he, he uh, jumped into Etna, the volcano, and he was supposed to rise up from the, the dead afterwards. But the story goes that after he jumped into Etna, the volcano, volcano his uh, sandals, they spew up and landed in front of his followers, and his followers should afterwards have said he was just a fraud. That's a very, very good story. And historians uh, generally don't think that this uh, was true. They think that Empedocles died of some sort of an accident. But the legend there of his uh, spectacular suicide, which is probably the most famous and spectacular uh, philosophical suicide that's ever uh, done by a philosopher in the history of philosophy, that is when Empedocles was uh, supposed to have jumped into Etna, the volcano. But what was Empedocles' uh, philosophy? Well, he's part of the pre-Socratic thinkers, and the pre-Socratic thinkers means that it was all the philosophers who were before Socrates. And they had something in common, all these uh, pre-Socratic philosophers, is that they were always uh, looking for this arche. This arche is a prime substance, a first uh, thing, it's a first principle. It's something that created everything from one substance or one entity or, or something like that. And, uh, and it could be water, it could be air, but for Empedocles, he combined a lot of these archaic uh, ideas into his four elements. We got water, we got earth, dirt, see here's some uh, dirt, and we got air. And of course, we got fire. Oh. And all of this were, became very, very big in the ancient world, both in the, the Greek, ancient Greece, and in, uh, later on in, in ancient uh, Rome with the four elements. Remember your astrology. You got water signs, you got air signs, you got earth signs, you got uh, uh, fire signs. So it became big, all these, with the four elements elements that everything is created and begins from these uh, four elements according to Empedocles. So that is his philosophy boiled down in a nutshell.